So we are currently heading to our town's Christmas tree lighting in the downtown area and this is the first time that we attend our town's Christmas tree lighting so I'm excited and looking forward to it. I'm trying to get in the Christmas spirit now that it's December 1st. How? I don't know but we made it this far. Stopped into a cute little cafe with some hot chocolate before we go watch the Christmas tree. Got our hot chocolate. Come Santa Claus, down Santa Claus Lane. He sees you when you're sleeping. Christmas tree lighting was so cute. I'm definitely feeling the holiday spirit. So we are here in Target now and maybe look for some Christmas lights for outside our house. Maybe a little ornament or something. Last night was so fun. The Christmas tree lighting was so magical and beautiful and it was just really nice to be surrounded by you know the whole community. Um, so that was really nice. It's four o'clock now and we are actually about to head out to a little holiday market. It's gonna be a bunch of vendors selling some artisanal goodies and so I wanted to check that out. We have our cutie little tree up. I haven't added the, all of the ornaments yet, just these. And I need to get a picture for this. And last night when we went to Target, we bought a bunch of these little uh, 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 uh. these Christmas lights for outside and I love these because they're pretty big I like the big bulbs and they're pretty like spread apart I like that style so I'm excited <laughs> Sunday and we are putting up the Christmas lights outside and I'm so excited. Well, Danny's putting them up. I'm just there for creative direction and to make sure he doesn't fall off the ladder. <laughs> We hung up half of the lights and it looks really pretty, um, but we didn't do the very top, like the second story, because it's just very high up. So I think we're gonna hire out a task rabbit to come and do that for us. I got bit so bad while I was out there. There were so many mosquitoes, so I have to do something about this. Um, but yeah, I'm just now gonna start dinner. I'm gonna make a lemony shrimp white bean stew. It is one of my favorite dishes to make. So let's make that. So we're gonna season the shrimp with lemon zest, garlic, and some habanero. Just a little bit. And um, salt and pepper and oregano. Ciao, que esté bien. Nos vemos. Okay. Now we are going to chop up the shrimp. 
chop up just the tiniest bit of this habanero. I'm a wimp, so I think that's all I'm gonna do. <laughs> Some salt. And oregano. I'm also going to take a little bit of these fennel um, leaves from the cold. Now I'm going to add in this jumbo shrimp that I have cleaned and deveined and mix it all in. Probably could have used a bigger bowl for this, but it's fine. I'm just gonna let this sit like this for a little bit before we cook it. Now I'm going to slice some shallots. <laughs> this shallot is strong. By the way, I was slicing up some fennel. I'm just gonna roughly chop the in the shallots and fennel, kind of deglazing whatever was left of the shrimp um, and letting this soak up again all those yummy flavors from the shrimp. And then I'm gonna pour in some chicken broth and then the beans. First I'm gonna add in some of this Tuscan herb infused olive oil that we got. Ooh, that was a lot. Um, to give it some more flavors. Um, I wish you guys could smell this. It smells so good. Okay, we're gonna add in the white cannelli bean. So you can either eat this by itself with a piece of bread, or you can eat it over a bed of rice. Me being the Latina that I am, I'm gonna eat it over a bed of rice. <laughs> it's really good either way. And that's Sunday dinner. Dinner was super delicious, but now I have a very messy kitchen that I need to clean up. <laughs> Before that, I, um, I just got in a box of Nespresso pods. We were down to like less than a sleeve, so we needed to stock up on some. We got our Nespresso machine earlier this year, and I have really loved it. It's quick, it makes my lattes perfect, and I love my regular cup of coffee, hot coffee in the morning, but in the afternoons, whenever I want like a little 
just something extra, like an espresso, that is perfect. So yeah, I've really been loving it. So let's see what we got. I know we ordered a bunch of different um, coffee pods. Now that is a beautiful sight to see. For this order that we just made, we were like eligible for a little gift or something. So we got um, these cute glass Nespresso mugs. They're pretty cute. We got two of them. So, fun. All right, we are closing up shop now here in the kitchen also going to end this vlog. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. I would love to have you here and I will see you in my next